the cornfield stretches for miles. Far from the illuminated farmhouse in the distance, a chilly autumn wind moves the cornstalks in waves. Two teenagers, Corrine and Ethan, run out into the field with flashlights, laughing. <laughs> <laughs> they disappear, their path revealed by the stalks' movements. They reappear in a cleared space in the field. Did anyone follow us? I don't think so. It's gotten cold. Ethan removes his backpack, takes out a blanket, and lays it on the ground. In the distance, a stalk snaps. Did you hear that? I didn't hear anything. Ethan lays on the blanket and pats it. I thought you said nobody followed us. They didn't, okay? Will you just relax? Karina lays down next to Ethan, and they cuddle. It's such a beautiful night. Not as beautiful as you. Oh, stop. They kiss. A stalk snaps. Closer this time. I heard it again. You're imagining things. We'd better go. Come on. This is the one chance we have to get some privacy. And you want to leave? The wind blows, but everything else is quiet. I guess you're right. They kiss again. Ethan slowly removes Corrine's clothes. Corrine unbuttoned Ethan's shirt. Ethan climbs on top of her. What's wrong? What is that? A stalk snaps right next to them and falls over, hitting Ethan in the head. Kareen shrieks and covers herself with the blanket. Ethan gets up and stumbles to the edge of the clearing, rubbing his head. Ow, what an... An unseen hand grabs Ethan's leg and pulls him into the field. He screams. Kareen screams. Kareen gets up and runs in the opposite direction, pushing aside corn stalks. A large object flies above her head and falls directly in her path. She runs straight into the dead, gory body of Ethan. She screams. She runs around the corpse and approaches the edge of the field. She breaks free of the wall of corn, only to be grabbed by the unseen hand and pulled back in. As she disappears, gory murder sounds emit from the field. Nearby stands a bar. Written on the side in dripping paint is the corn stalks. Like and subscribe for future segments.